How does Django process your requests? Let's follow the journey of a web request. You enter the name of a website powered by Django into your browser. The browser sends the request, essentially a string of bytes, to your web server like Nginx. If the request was for a static content like a CSS file, then it is served from the file system. If it is for a dynamic content, then it is passed on to a web server gateway interface, Whiskey server, like uWhiskey. Unlike a web server, Whiskey servers can run Python applications. The request populates a Python dictionary called Enron. It passes through several layers of middleware, ultimately reaching your Django application. URL configuration or URL conf module selects one of the views to handle the request based on the requested URL. Your request has now turned into HTTP request, a Python object. The selected view typically does one or more of several things. Talk to a database via the models. Render HTML or any other formatted response using templates. Return a plain text response. Or raise an exception like page not found. The HTTP response object gets rendered into a string as it leaves the Django application. Finally, your web browser renders it into a beautiful web page. This excerpt was taken from the book Django Design Patterns and Best Practices.